Hello and welcome. My name is Bill York and in this snip I'll show you how you can create custom logs using the REST API for Azure Log Analytics. First we'll go to our advanced settings under Log Analytics Workspace and we'll need our Workspace ID and our primary key. Copy those and save them for later because we'll be using them in our PowerShell code. In this example I'll be using customer ID and shared key as our variables to store those in. This particular example is from Microsoft's REST API documentation. It's useful for when you're connected to servers that don't have the OMS ingestion module installed. For this example though, I'll be using the OMS API ingestion module, which is available on GitHub. Whenever we're posting logs to the Log Analytics REST API, we need to define a log name. In this instance, in this instance I've called it TechSnips. When Log Analytics ingests this log, it will append an underscore CL, so our full log name will be TechSnips underscore CL. Next, we need a valid JSON payload. For this example, I've pulled the 10 most recent SNPs published on TechSnips.io. For this example, it is not important how I have got this information. Just know that you need a properly formatted JSON payload to submit to the Log Analytics API. Log Analytics REST API is fully documented, so if your payload is successful, it will return 200, and it will return other error codes if you are unsuccessful. Next, we need a timestamp field in the format of 115. Whenever we're submitting to the Log Analytics API, you need to include the timestamp field or the API will reject your submission. Next, we'll use the send OMS API ingestion file commandlet from the OMS API ingestion workspace tool, which again is available on GitHub and the PowerShell gallery. We'll include our customer ID, shared key, and our JSON payload and submit the log file to the API. As you can see, it was accepted and we got a return code of 200. Now, if we go to the Azure portal and go to our workspace, we can search our custom log. I'll enter TechSnips underscore CL and we can search. As you can see, we have a few logs. There are a couple things to note. The ingestion process will attempt to define each field in our submission. In this instance, it's added an underscore S for all of my fields, which is string. If I had any numbers in here, it would attempt to define them as doubles or possibly integers. There's also booleans that it will do. And that is how we can use PowerShell to submit custom logs to the Log Analytics Public REST API. Thank you for watching.